am Hannah from Faze and we have arrived at the last day of term before the summer holidays. And I wonder what it is that you are looking forward to, whether it's being able to get some extra sleep, seeing some friends, maybe having some time to relax. Well, by now, you will know that when it gets to the end of term at Fades, we love to have some fun, some laughter and a little bit of craziness. And we love to be able to share that with you. So today I am joined by Emily and by Kieran for Hannah's Holiday Quiz. So Emily and Kieran are going to go head to head. So Emily and Kieran, I have taken some well-known movie and TV characters and made them better with some members from the Hitchin Girls School. You have to guess who the character is and the staff member who has made it better. There will be one point for the character and one point for the staff member. Now you will both need some buzzers, otherwise it's not really a quiz or a proper game show. So you've both got cups of water. If you think you know who the character is, throw a cup of water at the other person. If you think you know who the staff member is, throw a cup of water at the other person. The winner gets this bar of chocolate and the loser, well, they get the bucket of water. So Kieran and Emily, test your buzzers to make sure they're working. <laughs> And so remember that there are two points up for grabs for each round. Okay, let's get started. The first character that we have. Uh, Shrek. Uh, Mr. Jackson. Oh well done, Kieran. You got both of those correct. It is Mr. Jackson as Shrek. Well done, Kieran. You take the lead. Okay, our second one. Uh, Miss Guns! Uh, Thor! No! no I am a... <laughs> our second character is indeed Miss Guns as Iron Man. Well done, Emily. You now both have two points. Our third character for you to guess. Um. Uh... Oh, Hermione Granger! Oh! Uh... Uh... Um, Miss Johns. Well done, Emily. It is Hermione Granger, but it is in fact Miss Johns, as Kieran said. So well done, Kieran. Well done, Emily. You are still on a draw. Okay, our fourth character. Okay, Batman. Oh, Mr. Lynn. Mr. Ferguson. Well done, Emily. It is Batman, and it is indeed Mr. Ferguson. Okay, so it all comes down to this. The deciding factor, Kieran, can you come back to make it a draw or has Emily taken the lead and won? Our last character. Katniss. Oh, um, uh, <laughs> Miss Maiden. It is Mrs. Maiden, Kieran. However, it is Katniss which means that Emily is our winner. Well done, Emily. You are the winner of Hannah's Holiday Quiz and this Dairy Milk Bar Chocolate is on its way to you now. And well, Kieran, you get the bucket of water. Well, hopefully that was a bit of fun for you to watch. I wonder how many you managed to guess correctly, both the staff members and the characters. Well, all of those characters that we showed, they face challenges. Yet we know that they face them in different ways to be able to overcome the obstacles that they faced. For example, in The Hunger Games, Katniss shows that determination to accomplish the tasks that are set before her, to overcome some of the obstacles that she faces, whilst also helping those around her along the way. We know that this past school year has continued to be one that hasn't been easy. The joys and the challenges that have been experienced along the way, from doing school online to not being able to see your friends as much, 
to adjusting to wear face masks when you came back to school and maybe even having to self-isolate. The disappointments and the things that have been cancelled throughout the year. This past year has been one that has been continually changing, where we have had to adapt to the circumstances that we find ourselves in. And challenges often require us to step outside our comfort zone, where perhaps we would much rather stay. It causes us to think differently, to look at things from a different perspective. Yet as we step out of our comfort zone, face those challenges and obstacles, it's often a place where we grow and where we learn things about ourselves. When we go through these times of challenges, it's important for us to be able to reach out for the support, to reach out to the community that we have around us and to also be that support to others. And at FaZe, we love to be able to be part of the Hitching Girls School community and to be able to support you on the journey. And so we really hope that as you head into the summer, you can be proud of all that you have done this past school year. The challenges that you have tackled and know that you are part of the Hitching Girls School, school community, where you can encourage and support one another. We hope that you have a great summer and look forward to seeing you in September. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, brother!